Hello everyone, I'm the Crimson Archer and welcome to RimWorld Alpha 12. This was just released and I am going to dig right in. I've already created a world and I'm in the character select screen. Uh, among the major features that got added is animal training and husbandry. And so there's a new skill level called animals. It's right there. And uh, I may end actually end up taking this guy. He, uh, he can't do social and he can't do medicine, but he's a hell of a shot and he likes animals. And he's a decent artist, too. So we're, we might be taking that guy. Uh, let's look at the others. Let's see who else we can get. Chemical interest, night owl, jealous. Um, this is a middle of the road folk. Uh, too smart. That's never that great. Construction, growing, mining, research. Not that good at research, but excited about it. We need a social person. So this guy's okay. He's media middle of the road and a lot of stuff. I want somebody who's social in medicine. That's what I'm looking for right now. Social 10, research 6. Social 10, medicine 5. Animals. Eh, ascetic, that's new. Her, she gets a mood loss if she has a too impressive bedroom. Oh, that's a new feature as well. The uh, impressiveness of rooms. We'll get into that though. Um, it's good construction, good cooking. Can't do cleaning, plant work, or artistic. That's probably in, in a brawler. That's too risky. Uh, nope. Social and research. Nobody's good at medicine, though. That's This is concerning to me. I kind of like this person, though. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep going, though. Mining and growing. Still no... No, can't do this. Social, medicine, well, all right, we're going with this person. They're too smart, but they're a fast walker. All right. Okie doke. We're going to go with this, and I will see you in just a second in-game. All right, so we are in-game. Um, we'll just jump through that. That's this normal intro thing here. All right. I just picked, in terms of world, too, I picked sort of a sort of standard mountainy, decent temperature range nothing too exciting um, but let's go over a few of the new stuff beforehand first you'll notice that if you're familiar with room you'll notice that the uh, menus down here have all changed it's all down here so now we have the architect like we've always had but the work tab is here now instead of in a, as is the restrictions and outfits and animals that's a new one we'll come back to that uh, reputation see so this is the world see so yeah, I just kind of picked a place that was kind of you know Top temperature 22, bottom temperature negative 3, standard kind of stuff. History, statistics, research. Yeah, I know, we can't do that yet. Thanks, game. So let's look at our people. Looks like somebody started with a... Oh, no, that's just wandering. Okay, just happened to be here? No, this guy belongs to somebody, doesn't he? Is he tame? He is tame. All right, so that'll uh, allow us to do that in just a second. But let's see. Let me... Uh... So we can tame animals now. We can keep pets, all that kind of stuff. So this guy, for some reason, started with us. And um, he's a warg, which is, which they're pretty uh, heavily muscled wolf-like creatures. Science say wargs are descendants of weaponized military animals created for population suppression. They're the kind of guys that would attack you with the, uh, the, the man, manhunter, man, manhunter attack that happened in the last one that doctors care but no medicine oh I guess you can decide what you want you get anything my friend um, so you can train them they have skills obedience is so that they actually follow a, a master release is so you can send them out to attack people rescue is they'll actually grab and drag people back to safety and hauling is they'll actually pick stuff up but according to Tynan in his um, video about all the features of this game of this particular release which I would recommend reading oh plasteel nice I re recommend watching if you have the time uh, they won't haul very often uh, just every great once in a while because otherwise it's overpowered so I guess we'll set up shop back here it's a little exposed for my tastes but the only other option is way over here and I don't really want to move everything so we're gonna go with close to where we started just as is 
So let's get the few zones set up and then we'll worry about other things. The downside of the warg, by the way, that he uh, told me, he, he said about, he didn't tell me specifically, he told all of us, um, is that they need meat to live. So we're going to have to be doing a lot more hunting than I usually do in this game. Um, which could be problematical. There is a decent amount of wildlife around. But worry about that. What is that? A hair? Aw, adorable. Um, we'll worry about that in a minute. Let's, let's get this taken care of first. Need to get a architect's zone. Get a stockpile. This will set up back in this corner. It's the yeah, I guess it's the most reasonable thing to do. We'll set up stuff back here. Stockpile and a dumping stockpile. Yeah, hate it when they accidentally run together like that. Okay. I always like to test that in every new build to see if they've changed it so that the so that they won't just attach to each other if you put them next to each other. Apparently they still will. Alright. Growing zone. Need food. It's right here. And we will start with... Eh, potatoes is fine. Alright, let me look at my people. Switch over to manual priorities, because I always do. He'll be my number one doctor. He'll be my number two doctor. Did they change? Oh, they just everybody starts at three this time. Alright, everybody firefights. Everybody patients. Everybody flicks. That's switching light switches on and off. You'll do this. You're gonna be my number one handler, but the others can do it too. Let's see. Put everybody on everything. Except for obviously the things that they're incapable of doing. Five and five. Alright, and they're the same on research. So let's see. Maybe bump everybody up on plant cutting and mining. Growing. Actually, plant cutting can go down. I always forget that plant cutting is not cutting grown plants. It's cutting other stuff. Bump you up on that. All right, somebody's got to haul first. Who's going to be the least important? You're going to be the least important first, so you're going to haul for me. Everybody cleans. All right. All right, that'll work for now. All right, let's give people guns. You are not shooter at all. You are my best shot. So you take the big rifle. You take the pistol. You are a... You're incapable of violence, so I'm not even going to give you the knife. And this guy is going to need food. So, yep, I know you need beds. We're going to build... A. Actually, I need to uh, unrestrict that. Orders. Build. Not structure. There we go. Structure. Wooden wall. Where do we want to put this to start with? I'd like to actually build a colony that's halfway decent looking this time, which is be a change for me because I have a tendency to build um, but ugly things. Grump is throwing up. Because why wouldn't you? Let them go here. I should probably take... This guy is going to get hungry relatively quickly and start training you in obedience. Um, so we should probably go kill... Oh, we can kill this hair right here, actually. Alright. There you go. When it comes time, he can eat that. Let's put some, some sleep spots in here. One, two, three. This gives us a chance to show off this menu here. Is it this one? It's room stats display, yep. So now there are rooms that acquire stats, basically. So like, this is the barracks because it's sleeping three people. Its impressiveness is dull. Its wealth is impoverished. Its space is rather tight. It's ugly and it's a little dirty. So, that's kind of a new neat little extra feature that we will 
no doubt look into a lot more in the near future. In the meantime, we need to get some basic stuff up and running. So let's get, first thing we need is some power, probably. Steel animal sleeping box. Fit smaller animals, blah, blah, blah. Okay, oh, so let's speak. Doesn't need to spot on the ground where the animal would, should sleep. Aw, you can sleep there, buddy. Oh, I got distracted. Distracted by the sleep spot. So let's see. We need, the first things we need are going to be, we need a butcher table, which we put outside anyway, so we can put this here. And we need a smithing sculptor, cook stove, Research bench, which we can also put out here. Actually, no, I'm gonna build a new building before I put that in there. This is a butcher creature. Do it forever. There we go. Now we got some meat to feed to our dog. Keep him nice and happy. There you go. Alright. Take off that. Look at all the animals sleeping. All the little Z's everywhere. That's funny. Alright, let's look at our our work. So we need we put work across all this for now for a second. And then we will put some joy in here. Some some joy in the middle of the day. And everybody gets an hour of joy at the end of the day. How's that sound? Everyone happy about that? That's not the button I wanted to click. Alright, so let's get another building up and running here, shall we? Where do we want to put it? Wooden wall. I'm just going to build it right here next to this. Gonna be our main facility. Probably needs a door of some kind. Put one door right there, one door right here, one door right there. There we go. Hopefully we enough wood. If we don't, we'll just do some some chopping. Yes, chop some wood down, guys. Need to get that wood out from inside anyways. We should also harvest. I mean, we shouldn't, don't have to, but I'm gonna harvest any of this. Any of these uh, berries that are in the area. How are you doing? I'm worried about this guy getting hungry. The zero starvation damage over time. I'm, I also worried that like, because it's a, a, a beast, you know, the warg is not exactly a super friendly animal. But if it gets hungry, it'll go crazy and kill us. Grump, what are you upset about, man? Crowded. Joy deprived. Slept in the cold. Is it cold? That's not that bad. Slept on the ground. Shared bedroom. In a little pain. Off the ground. Blah, blah, blah. Lots of things to complain about. I understand. Let's build a second room next to you, and we'll start separating you guys out. Eh, bad terrain. Actually, we can still work with this. Is it right there? No, all right, that's right there. Cancel, cancel. Type in wooden wall like this. Can we move these? They have the ability, we have the ability to move furniture now. It's a new addition in this uh, build. But you can't do it with things like that. So this is probably, it was probably not my best choice to put the butcher table there, which we'll probably have to move it in a second. But I'm gonna go this, we'll subdivide this room in half in a minute after this gets eaten out a little bit like that. I'd like to get some power up and running as well, so let's see. Solar power, 
We'll start with solar, I guess. Solar's good as anything. How you doing, buddy? Hungry, okay. Alright, this is gonna be... Keeping this thing fed is gonna be a problem. Hunt, hunt. Actually, take the tortoise out of there. Yeah, all right, that's working. All right, so we have a total of what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight internal space, so we can do a four and a three. That's not really very good, is it? start thinking about how to do more rooms. And I'm going to deconstruct this thing and rebuild it over here. I don't know why they're not finishing this job. More sleepy animals. I don't know if we can tame anything. Hi, Leah. Works for me. Try and tame one of these. Tame a U and a buck. See if it works. Still can't get this guy. I bet wargs are hard to train in obedience, to be honest, now that I think about it. Also, I need to want to do some zones here. Hang on. Expand allowable zone, animal area one. Put animal area one right there. Right near the near the house. There we go. Alright. This room is still not finished either. Let them finish all this work first before I give them more work to do. Yeah, I know, Grum. You're upset. What is this? Visitors? Alright. So we'll go wood wall, hold it out this way. I'm just gonna go like this. Whoops. We don't really need that big of a dumping stockpile right now. Orders. So let's see. One, two, three. That was not where I wanted to put that. Damn it. Put that there. It's here. Three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That might work. All right. Hey, buddy. It's a rival rifle, huh? Some shoddy worksmanship. Need a meal source. I know. I'm working on it. Production. Put a new butcher table. We'll put it out here this time. Get things all chopped out. To redo this bill now. I want to get rid of those things in the way too. Orders, all things. You guys are in my way right now. Why is that granite chunk can't be hauled? Oh, that because that's in the that's actually in the thing. <laughs> Never mind. Delete. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Not exactly what I meant to do there. It's okay. Dumping stockpile. We'll put it over here instead. Hey, we got some power. Oh, we got a mad animal. Crazy tortoise. 
Incoming. It's gonna take it a while. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. Don't wait for me. Hope this blue's gonna get attacked by this tortoise. It's coming to visit. Look out, mad tortoise on the loose. Oh, maybe not. All right, guys. There we go. All right. Go about your day. All right. So let's see. We'll put a new door here. We'll deconstruct that. I want to deconstruct all of this and replace it. Let's see, one, two, three. One, two, three here. One, two, three. One, two, three. This is going to be still not the right, quite, quite, quite the right shape because I didn't measure it out. Cargo pods, huh? A whole bunch of meat. That's excellent. Elephant meat. batteries yeah all right yeah let's actually let's do the job here need to build a small room here it's gonna be our battery room for the moment Good power right there one two three four batteries yeah I know grump I'm working on it my friend Beavers! Okay, hang on. Wooden bed. Right in the middle of the room. That'll be yours, Grump, because you can't seem to get over it. Actually, I don't know, I thought about trying to tame them, but there's no way we'd tame beavers. Wanderer joins. Hey, Kelly. Psychically dull and a green thumb. Good at crafting and construction and mining and medicine. Actually, uh, welcome aboard, my friend. I am happy to have you, even if you are naked. Oh, you're wearing pants. Never mind. All right, I'm going to stop right here for today. I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, consider leaving me a like. Helps me a great deal. And um, I'll see you later. Thanks so much.